How is it going, everybody? You're watching Then About Tech, and finally, finally, we can use Face ID to unlock the iPhone while wearing a mask. This is a new feature Apple implemented in iOS 15.4, which is called Face ID with a mask, and it works perfectly. Let me show you. So, I'm not wearing an Apple Watch or anything. My iPhone is locked. As you can see, the padlock is closed. And all I have to do is point it at my face, swipe up, and my iPhone is unlocked. Just like that, and it works perfectly. So, without further ado, let me show you how you can enable this feature right now on your iPhone. Let's go. So, it's actually super easy, and as I mentioned before, you need to be updated to iOS 15.4 or newer. So, make sure to go to your settings, and then scroll down, tap on general, and then software update, and make sure you're on iOS 15.4 as I am, or newer. Please keep in mind that at the time of recording of this video, iOS 15.4 is still on a beta version, so Apple hasn't released the official version just yet. So if you look for 15.4 and you can't find it, that's why. So just wait a little bit and Apple will make official, but of course, maybe when you're watching this video, it will be official, maybe it will be on 15.5 or even on iOS 16, okay? But just keep that in mind. So if you really, really wanna get 15.4 right now, and uh, late January 2022 or, or early February, you have an option which is installing the beta profile. So you can enroll your iPhone on, on Apple's beta software program. I have a link on the description to this website so you can enroll your device, install the beta profile and get iOS 15.4 right now early and install the beta version, all right? So you can get it right now if you want to, just like I got. Now. Now that we're on 15.4 or later, all you gotta do is open up the settings once again. Let's go back to the first page of your settings, scroll down and go to Face ID and Passcode. Tap on Face ID and Passcode. You're gonna type in your passcode, your lock string passcode, and then tap on Done. And as you can see, we can see the Face ID and Passcode menu. And all you gotta do is take a look at this feature, which is use Face ID with a mask. And as you can see, it'll be turned off by default, and then you can just turn it on. But very important information, you'll see that the information that's written down here, that Face ID is most accurate when it's set up for full face recognition only. So Apple is telling you that it'll be more precise and it'll be more secure if you're using Face ID to recognize your whole face. But if you wanna use it with a mask, you can. And the coolest thing is everything will work perfectly. So it'll unlock your iPhone. It'll be good for Apple Pay. It'll be good for iTunes and App Store, uh, for your passwords and, and, and autofill, everything. So even though it's saying it's a little bit less accurate and less secure, but it works the exact same way and you can do everything you do with Face ID, you can do with Face ID with a mask. All right, so keep that in mind. Now, all you gotta do is enable the feature. And as you can see, you'll see this menu right here, use Face ID with mask, giving you the information that I just gave you. And then all you gotta do is tap on use Face ID with mask, the first option right there. Tap the option, and then you need to rescan your face once again, even if you already have Face ID as you saw, but you need to rescan it once again. So you're gonna tap on get started point it to your face and keep in mind that this scan you're gonna do right here, you don't need to be wearing a mask. As you can see, I'm not wearing a mask, you can see it, and this scan is a normal scan without wearing a mask. So as you can see, I'm just gonna go through the cycle, the circle, and then face ID complete, face ID is now set, done, and everything is normal and everything is working. Again, this face ID, even though it's with a mask, you gotta do it without wearing a mask, all right? If you're wearing glasses, I do recommend that you tap here on add glasses and go through the options, uh, just because as you can imagine, face ID with a mask, we rely only uh, at looking at your forehead and your eyes. Therefore, if you're wearing glasses, if you wear glasses, it's important that you tap here uh, in order to face ID with mask work better. Since I don't wear glasses, I don't need to do anything else, I'm done. One extra very important piece of information is this feature face ID with a mask, at least for now, that iOS 15.4 is still on a beta, 
is only compatible with the iPhone 12 series and the iPhone 13 series. So if you have iPhone 11 or older, this feature is not compatible at least just yet. Let's wait until the official version of iOS 15.4 is out. Maybe it'll be available for more devices, all right? Now, now that we're done, that's it. Let me actually show you this feature in action a couple more times just so you see how good it is. So let me demonstrate the feature a couple more times. So as you can see, iPhone locked, just pointed at my face, swipe up, unlocked, I'm gonna lock it again, tap the screen, locked, pointed at my face, swipe up, unlocked. So as you can see, it works just like normal Face ID. There's no delay, it doesn't take any more than a blink of an eye, it works the exact same way, it's perfect. So, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit the like button down below if it was helpful to you. I do appreciate your like. I also appreciate if you could subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I post a new video like this. And last but not least, hit the comment box down below and let me know your thoughts about the video. I always do appreciate your feedback. So, that's pretty much it. And I'll see you in a few days as usual. Bye-bye.